Hi everyone, it's Mitch. It's uh, September 22nd. It's the first day of fall, and it's also the first uh, It's week five in college football. Uh, not a particularly attractive slate of games this week. I mentioned it in the blog yesterday. I'll be probably blogging about it even more, about just uh, you know how, how without the points, that most of these games just are not that attractive. Yeah, we have a few marquee games. You know, we have uh, Georgia taking on Alabama. We have, uh, you know, Penn State maybe getting the first real test in Illinois. And, um, you know, Nebraska versus Virginia Tech, you know, not generally an attractive game, but uh, maybe this week it, it, it is because it doesn't have much competition. Um, Oklahoma, uh, TCU, once again, uh, you know, you'd expect the Sooners to roll in that one at home, but, uh, you know, the Horn Frogs, they can be tough. So, um, you know, I, I looked at the, at the lines. Um, they're not out everywhere, but uh, I did get a hold of some of the early lines, and I was surprised that, that the favorites, they're just not as, as, as big a numbers as I was expecting. So maybe this is a great opportunity. Maybe we're walking into a trap. Those guys who make those lines, they're generally very, very close. Um, we got so lucky on that Iowa game last week. We, were, we got in early. We got Iowa getting a point and a half. They ended up laying a point. The game went one point, you know, with, with with Iowa actually losing. So we're one of the few people that actually um, won that game. And, uh, you know, we're, we're always grateful to get a win. It sure, it sure beats the alternative, and uh, we'll take it. Um, you know, sometimes, you know, getting an early works our advantage. Sometimes getting an early, uh, you know, works against us. Um, that time it certainly worked for us. And we're going to we're gonna hope that that's the case again this week. You know, at least we're going to jump on the, on the uh, you know, the favorites. Because that seems to be the way the line in general will move, is that most people pick the favorites. So, you know, the lines will move in, in that direction of the favorites. Unless you see something really, really crazy like, like we saw last week with Iowa. Um, you know, we never understood the, the point move last week in, in the North Carolina-Virginia Tech game, and uh, neither did the Hokies, apparently. So, uh, you know, that was, an, that was we got advantage, you know, we took advantage, we got the money line on that one. Um, we never understood the point spread in Wake Forest, Florida State, and uh, we got the money line on that one as well. So, it was, you know, it was, we, it was a decent week overall last week. Was it wasn't our best, you know, and it is certainly, you know, anytime you have a winning week, it's not going to be your worst. So, uh, you know, we'll we'll try and jump on some of these point spreads early. You know, the one I'm looking at, of course, is the Thursday night game, USC only laying 23 and a half against Oregon State. I say only because I think uh, that one could be covered by the first quarter. Tulane against SMU, 17 points, even even that for uh, you know the one and two green wave seems seems a little low. Um, you know, Georgia's laying six against Alabama. I'm not so sure if that's good or if it's not good. Uh, Auburn laying six and a half at home against Tennessee. The Vols, uh, I'm done with you guys. You guys uh, have really shown me very little this year. And I, I'm, you know, normally I'm all over you guys. But uh, maybe maybe this is the year that I have to say uh, no more. So, uh, you know, we'll, we'll see. Florida State is, is a favorite after, you know, not even really hitting the board against Wake. Uh, they're favored again against Colorado. Go figure. You know, Miami favored against North Carolina. They haven't beaten them in a while. And, you know, but the Canes, they, they do look, you know, they do look pretty good. And, uh, you know, no, one, no one's happier about that than I am. So, in any event, we, we do have, you know, college football this week. And, uh, you know, it might not be the uh, USC Ohio State week or, you know, Oklahoma, Texas, which we have coming up. We have Florida LSU coming up, you know, and all these great things. But we do have Georgia, Alabama. We do have, a, you know, you throw in the points and, and you never know what's going to happen so this is mitch thanks for joining me i'll be back all week talking college football